All right, howdy y'all. Welcome back to Luke's Homebrew. Um, so, gotcha. Thought we were gonna do Doris, huh? Well, we got the uh, PC working. Uh, OBS. To anyone who has not used it, just know that it is a pain in the butt. I struggled with this thing for hours trying to get it to work. My computer has been set up for the past week, but I have just been trying to adjust settings. Everything that could have gone wrong went wrong. And that right there is Murphy's Law. So today, uh, as you will see up on the display, uh, we are doing the no perks challenge. All the rules are listed above, but I figure I'll just verbally tell you as well. So, uh, I don't know. I'm just going to verbally tell you. Um, so obviously like challenge suggests, we're not getting any perks. We can pack a punch. Uh, obviously in black ops one, there's no gobble gums. Um, other than that, yeah, we can hit the box, use whatever traps really exist on this map in particular. Um, but yeah, we got none of that. So I'm excited. It's going to be a fun game. Five is a very hard map, but we've actually done rather well on some pretty hard maps. It's really Wonder Weapon or Bust. And lately we've been pretty lucky. Uh, that being said, we don't really have much of a Wonder Weapon to work with. So it's really Ray Gun or Bust. Um, the Winter's Howl might be useful to us to some degree, but really it comes down to, oh, I don't want to get clipped there. Uh, really it's going to probably come down to the ray gun. Um, because that seems to be our saving grace in a lot of the other maps. Oh, boy. Oh, nope, 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 nope. I increased my mouse sensitivity. Black Ops 1 is a little finicky. I don't know if anyone else that's played it before on PC. It just seems like it moves slower than on any other game. So, uh, if I look like a fucking noob on PC gaming, that's why. So, round predictions. I don't have super high hopes, but I definitely want to try and get to 15. Honestly, I'll be happy with 12 or 13. I think those are definitely attainable unless we do something remarkably stupid. Um, but... I think um, 15 is definitely on the table. We're going to be lucky to get 20 or even close to 20. But uh, as long as we play it smart, I think we can do it. Um, the main strat, since I believe this is a three hit kill system in Black Ops 1, but I don't honestly remember. The strat is just to stay as far away from the zombies as possible. Uh, use and abuse uh, insta kills and nukes as soon as we see them because they are game changing. And yeah, we're just gonna have fun. I, I like this challenge and I think a lot of you do. I've seen a lot of recent viewership, um, which is awesome. It's really exciting to see that, especially on some older videos. So uh, it shows that the YouTube algorithm is actually working. Um, and hopefully soon you will see some, uh, I'll, actually a lot of uh, variants in my vi videos. I'm going to continue doing COD Zombies. I'm planning on seeing this challenge through to the end. Uh, but we're doing a Far Cry series. We are going to do a uh, whole bunch of D&D videos. Most of them coming out right now for D&D are going to be related to my homebrew topics. So if you do only see those for a few weeks, don't be discouraged. I have topics coming, um, but I'm trying to also build a little bit of viewership and I get a lot of downloads from DMs Guild. So if I can throw those videos on there, it helps grow the channel a little bit more in my opinion. It might not and uh, we'll see, but just know there's a lot coming down the pipeline. So hold tight, more is coming. Um, Honestly, yeah, we'll be able to get that. Hope so. Yeah, there we go. Um, let's kill a few more of you, and then we can head down. I think we'll have enough points for the power.
Yep. We'll let them respawn down here, and we'll open up to power. M14 is such a god weapon. Um. Oh, oh come on. Obviously, it's been a wee bit since we've played PC. Um. Take that down. Load that. Oof. I wish I got this all set up before I was doing the other videos, but hey, it's alright. Alright, power's on, which means Pentagon Thief can now uh, play with us in, in appropriate ways. Alright, took our pistol, that's alright. I don't plan on getting Mustang Sally. To be perfectly honest, guys, I have not played this map for probably six years. It's been a long ass time. And we're probably gonna lose it, that's okay. We just don't have a good gun. He came a little too early. Yep, we lost him. That's alright. Get our max ammo. Downside is we're stuck in the lab, so let's call this back. Let's get out of here as soon as possible. Alright. Out of there. Round six. Not the most perfect rounds, especially with a Pentagon Thief, but I think that's really the best we can really ask for, that he just took our pistol. He came a little bit earlier than I was hoping for. Alright buddy, um, let's... Yeah, I don't remember if it was a two or three hit system. Um, and you're a lot darker than I remember. Um, oh jeez. How did I make it through that? Not the best round, we don't really have a good setup right now. We opened the wrong door to the box because I'm an idiot. And that's on me. Consider yourself itemized. Really, I have only just begun. A zombie? You pay for that, rock base. that was almost pretty bad. How much are you? 1500, fuck. Get out of that. Get out. Yeah, this is going to be interesting gameplay for you guys. Um, I am high key stressed. I don't really want to be in this particular situation with just an M14. No perks. Alright, we're going to grab the stakeout. We need something to kill these zombies quicker. I know some people think the stakeout is a bad gun, but frankly, this was one of my favorite guns in Black Up Zombies. I would almost always just immediately pack a bunch of this gun. Granted, it's got low point output, but frankly, it's, it's for what we're going for right now, it is exactly what we need. Alright, now the goal is to save up points. Stakeout will last us a few more rounds at least. We gotta get these doorways open. There should be two or three of them? I don't remember. I think just the two. Yeah, just the two. Just the two. Oh jeez. 
Okay, maybe it's not as good as I remember, guys. Alright. Yep, um, elevator is going to be our saving grace. And ideally, let's actually try and... That was close, that was close. Alright, we're good, we're good. Repairing the window, we're doing okay. We're, we're doing okay. Alright, we're doing good guys, we're doing good. Not stressed or anything. Just trying to save up our points. I shit you not, this is the first time I've played this map in about six to seven years. But frankly, oh boy, oh boy, that was stressful. Alright, here's the plan, yeah, we're just going to use and abuse the elevator until we get some more points. We can open up that other door. And then we can go from there. And I'm going to have some of the spawns come in on over here. And then press F. And get us up to the next floor. Alright. Three, two, one. Because that elevator door to watch is a lot more dangerous than this one. So I'd much rather watch this. A longer hallway it's got one it's got an extra window but I'd rather that than the other way around I'm not taking any chances boys we're going to milk this elevator dry let's get that guy oh yeah The only downside with this elevator is if a zombie comes in here, it's life or death. And honestly, um, I, I honestly right now I'm just hoping for round 10. No perks. I'd be good with that. I would not be unsatisfied. And considering we're on round 8, I think that's attainable. Ooh, is that a death machine? Oh yeah, that's that's big. Not gonna be useful in later rounds, but for now it is a blessing. Oh, I love how the original death machine looked. Oh, and you can repair windows in Black Ops One with the death machine. That is different. Um. Yeah, I think that's it. That was huge. Being able to get that death machine. Alright, let's re reload. 2,000 points. Plenty of ammo. Not the two best guns in the world, but we're going to save up a little bit more. How one stimulates progress. And get us to round 9. Honestly, I hope hope this is an entertaining video for you guys. I've already made a few clutch pulls. My luck is thinning, but we got a strat. Um, next round, or this round, we're going to save a zombie and hit the box. I think that's going to be our plan. Alright, yeah, we're just going to hit that. I know it's an insta-kill, but that reload was a little janky. So, let's flip up to this, see if any zombies appear in that window. We might even be able to stick around here until the insta-kill wears off. Yep, let's just go back up. Alright. This is the cheekiest strategy in the world. Not even going to lie. But it's our strategy right now. A little close. Not going to lie. Just a little. Alright, let's reload. Cheekiest strategy in the world. And I'm not even British, so I'm not even sure why I'm saying that. 
I am a good American. Just a small American boy. That was a little close. Slowly gaining points though. Um, definitely not the best strategy we could be running points wise, but honestly I'm not worried about points. If we could get Jug, we'd be training down there right now, but yeah, we'll just hit that. I'm so glad there isn't a timer back and forth on this thing. It's it's so cheaty, but I love it. That's a shame. That's a really big shame. I hope that isn't the round. I really hope that isn't round. No, it isn't. Very cool. That must be like one or two zombies left. We'll chill out here. See how many are left. Oh, we're so lucky. Okay. Yeah, it's just that one guy. Let's go hit the box at least once, see if we can trade out the M14. Oh, you spawned in again real quick. Alright. Yeah, I can't believe we didn't see that out the window. Alright, something good. That is not something good. Let me take it though. Come on. Alright. Well, we're gonna have to chill out here for a little bit. Hopefully, honestly, I hope it's a Pentagon Thief round. Oh, fuck yeah. This is round 10 for us. Can't kill us, technically. Oh my god, the recoil on this thing. Yep, yep, just take my specter. I'd rather the stake up to be perfectly honest. Oh, stamina up, where are you at? We're probably not gonna get that either. We just don't have a good gun. Yeah, it's probably going to disappear. Yep, that's that, and we didn't even reload. But, alright, he took our gun, whatever. We can live with that. Here's the plan, though. This is going to be a really tight round, because we just have the stakeout. Yeah, I'm not playing this very well at all, but that's okay. Oh god, there is a lot of you. Alright, we have just enough points to use the other elevator. So that's what we're going to do. Gonna get up to you. Please don't let there be any zombies in my way. Alright. And now we got... No! Oh, see, I told you. Zombie gets stuck in there. I got a little too cheeky. I want to try and snag a few extra points. That's a game. That's not my proudest game, but we're going to stick with that. Um, that's five for you. No perks. I haven't played in six years, so that's my excuse. I promise I'm better. Um, but if you did enjoy the video, I hope it was entertaining. Um, please think about liking, comment, subscribe. You know the drill. Uh, thank you very much. I really appreciate it. And have a good one. Bye.